All right. Hello, everybody, and welcome to Let's Play Sarugetsu Million Monkeys. And that was. Yeah, that was a pretty bad accent. I have him out of practice, clearly. Ape Escape Million Monkeys is what this game is. Uh. Oh no. Uh oh. Aw, oh, crap. Aw, oh, damn it. Alright. This is gonna kill my stream. I don't know yet. No, it's not killing my stream. Okay, anyways. So, yes. What is Ape Escape? Ape Escape is a game about catching a billion joey monkeys. And this game is entirely in Japanese. This game never came out in English. It was gonna come out in Europe, but it didn't. And I have uh, been provided this game by a good friend who may or may not be watching the stream right now. I'm gonna leave his name out of this in case he gets spam. And we're gonna go game this title. So, uh, I'm gonna do this one. I'm gonna treat this uh, stream project as if it's an actual let's play instead of a stream project. So, for the most part, it's probably gonna be solo commentary. Anyways. So, I'm going to do my best to translate these menus, because I can read katakana, and most of these menus are written in katakana or hiragana. And there's very few kanji, but usually you can figure out what it's saying. Anyway, this is your memory card select screen. you got slot 1, slot 2, and skip. So, just don't save. We're going to go with slot 1. That says, uh, slot 1 de yorushi desu ka. I'm going to say that means save. We're close enough to can I save here? And let's see, 1397. That would be my test file. We're gonna save over this. Okay. Our main menus. Story model. Uh Koro I see okay, that third character from the left, I can never tell if that is Oh, okay, wait, never mind, that's she. So, Koroshia... Oh, Kor Colosseum mode. Got it. There's... If you look down right here, the second character from the very far right, it looks almost the same as the third character here, and I always mix them up, so I can never tell if it's suit or she. But, you know, whatever. Versus mode, obviously. This says, uh, Fire Sirecto. Uh... Character edit. I can't tell. That first character, there's a little thing there. I can't tell if that's a circle or two dashes. Let's see. Uh, ba, bas, uh, password. Okay, it's a password. There are, actually, yeah. I don't have the passwords to input right now, but if you input certain passwords, I can throw them up on screen. For the archive version, I can throw them up on screen right now. Boom. Let's hope I remember to edit that. There's some passwords to uh, unlock secret characters. Uh, this is options and mororu. That would be back. So anyways, enough of that. We're gonna actually going to edit a character. Now, unlike uh, Ape Escape 1, 2, and 3, and similar to Ape Escape Pumped and Primed, the arena game, you have char uh, specific character files that you can edit. So we're going to start a new one here. We've got Kakeru, Spike, in the English version. Uh, Hakase. Hakase. Uh, that would be the professor. Uh, Natsumi. That would be Natalie in the English version, I believe. Uh, Charu. That I forget her name in the English version. Uh, she she's in Pumped and Primed. I don't remember. Uh, people. Uh, da, 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 da. Saru Chima. Uh, the p monkey team. Spectre. <laughs> people Tron G. I can't. I cannot. I can never not laugh at this guy. He's hilarious. Anyways, we're gonna play a Spike because I actually. We're gonna rename him Spike, also. 
I forget how to delete characters. There it is. I actually played this game a very long time ago, and my save got lost when I lost my memory card. But I translated a bunch of the item combinations for when you start m uh, melding items together. So that's why we're going to play spikes. I know what those combinations actually are. Did I press the wrong thing? I hope I didn't. I hit a button. That might be a bad button. The screen went black. Okay, there it is. Okay. Uh, okay, these menus. Let's see here. Sobi Henko. I think it's equipment. I actually don't know that word. I'm pretty sure it's equipment. Uh, Saru. Saru. Puku. Saru Puku. Uh, something about monkeys. Nickname. Henko. Whatever Henko means. Uh, exu, exitara, extra, extra. Gachi mecha apple. That would be gacha gadgets. Gacha gadgets, gacha gadgets, whatever you call them. Uh, chip, chipu, chipu, mabu, whatever. This is where you do stuff. Sobi Henko. What's Sobi Henko? I forget. Yes, gadgets. Okay, okay, okay. I remember. Namai Henko. I guess Henko means change or something like that? I forget. We'll call this... Um, we'll just call it... Whoops, wrong button. I always forget that this game uses X for stuff. Net. We'll just call it the gut. Actually, can we call it the gotcha net? There's a limited number of characters. Space. Net. Perfect! Okay, that's that. I'm not gonna bother renaming all these, actually. I can do that on my own time. Uh, costume. We have an extra costume for Spike, but I like this one better. So we're gonna keep that. Uh. Shogun. What's it? Ah, I forgot what that is. Whatever. I'm not even really reading it. This would be, I think you, you can... Ah, this would be our collection of all the monkeys. Nickname, Spike, if we want to change that. Extra, I don't think we have anything. Gotcha, Mecha. I think this is where we actually set what we have. Gotcha, Mecha. Oh, no, no, no. This is where you make stuff, right? Whoops, a daisy. We're going to get out of that menu. And we're going to save... Some people, I can tell, are going to be like, how are you reading all of this? It's because I took one semester of Japanese. And I would really like to, uh, I would really like to take more than one semester. I would like to become fluent in Japanese if it's ever possible. Who knows if that'll ever happen. For now, I have what I've got. Did I go back into the menu by mistake? I probably did. I kind of like... At some point, I'm just tuning out whatever's happening on screen and kind of doing it by uh, just uh, muscle memory. Story mode, okay. So, you can play Episode Kakeru, which would be like the Spike story, or you can play Spectre's story. They vary only a little bit. I think they all play the same stages, I'm pretty sure. It's just like the cutscenes are different, and the cutscenes are completely indecipherable to me anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Character road. Slot one. We're gonna get our spike, and we shall begin the story. And I shall be quiet.
Okay, so that's your opening to this game. Uh, like I said, very little understanding of what anybody said there. My vocab is pretty limited. I can, however, say that I know the basic plot of this game. People th monkeys taking over the world with guns and mechs and stuff, and everyone thinks it's Spectre's fault because they saw Spectre. It's not Spectre, actually. It's an alien who looks like Spectre. Spectre's actually on vacation right now. That's he, His story starts with him on va vacation going, the hell? I didn't do this. Okay, anyways. Now, I never liked having my stun club on triangle. That's for losers. I like it on X. The circle is for my dash boots. Square is for my gotcha net. Triangle is for my gun. There's like a, let me see here, there's a bomb thingy. Where is it? Bomb thingy. RC car, whatever. I don't use that. That's for losers. Uh, uh, these are all your special abilities. There's a meter that fills up. When you fill it up, you can use a special ability by pressing two buttons at the same time. What do we have here? Um, don't worry about it. I, translations on screen. Boom. Again, I hope I, uh, I hope I actually put that in there and didn't forget. Mr. Brood Hater says Spike's hair is weird. I say your hair is weird. Okay, so the controls in this game differ. Watch, got wrecked. Controls in this game differ a little bit from, uh, d d d d what you call it, from regular Ape Escape. Notably, if you press the button that the if you press the button that the gadget is equipped to, you actually use the gadget. The right stick, you still use it for stuff, 
but it's not the only way to use your gadgets now. Oh! And there's targeting, which is weird. And the fact, well, the fact that you have a straight up a gun is pretty weird. So I guess there's that. You still jump with uh, the shoulder buttons. Actually, just R1 now. Now that I forgot about it. R2 crouches. And I get a triple jump in the form of a giant uh, thruster pack. Okay, let's wreck this guy. And by wreck this guy, I mean lose at a boss fight that you have to lose. I think. I think you have to lose this boss fight. I don't remember. Let's hope that you have to lose here. Oh, okay. So, anyways, those three bars at the top screen. The top horizontal one, that's my health. The bottom horizontal one, that's the meter for the special abilities. The circular one, that's uh, the energy in my gadgets. If you notice, it goes down when I use my boots. That's because the boots have a little bit of energy. Now I'm going to get completely annihilated, like I'm supposed to. I think you actually can beat this thing if you're super amazing. But it doesn't change anything, so... At least I've never heard of it changing anything. Kill me already! Let's go! I'm just gonna keep hitting the button. I probably should've ran in there just so I could die, but who cares. I'm dead now, so sooner, sooner or later I'll be dead. Come on! Why can't I move? Or jump or do anything. Okay, battle ended. Cool. Yeah, Scarlet Blackface. It's. All outcomes are the same. I'm gonna be try. I'm gonna try to be quiet for the cutscenes in the unlikely event that someone watching this video knows enough Japanese to translate these cutscenes for me. I don't know what this, uh, what these points are for. I don't know if there's a in-game leaderboard or anything. Okay, we have a chip. You meld chips together to make new gadgets and get monkeys and crap. Let's see. This one is. Well, I didn't get to read it. It started the gate. G E. And a whole bunch of saving screens. Cutscene, maybe? No, no cutscene. Okay! How long have we been going for? Like, 45 minutes and we've barely gotten into a... No, barely gotten into a, a mission. Whatever. That's what happens when you play a Japanese game. Uh... Stage select all or... Character edit. We shall go select another stage. And by select stage, I mean go to stage one? Can I count this as stage one, or should I count this as stage two? Uh, does it say anywhere? Oh, calls a mission two, okay. So, options and start. Well, equipment select, but. Yeah, I'll keep it all the same. I pretty much keep it this way the entire game. In Apescape 1, 2, 3, Improved, Improved, and this game, it's always the same. Okay, now, you know why this game's called Million Monkeys? Because a billion friggin' monkeys. What? Okay, if I'm really good at this game, if I remember how to be good at this game, I can be awesome. There you go. Monkeys can actually escape. If you alert them and give them the chance, like knock their armor off and give them the chance, they will run away and you cannot capture them. Every stage has a goal, which is usually not the same as collect uh, X amount of monkeys. Usually the goals in this game are like, get to a certain area, capture a certain amount of story-related monkeys, or whatever. Where's that guy? There he is. There he is! No. When they teleport out like that, they're trying to escape. And no one escapes. Yeah. Oh yeah! I love doing combos like that. This game is full of just stuff. Ah. Okay, now I'd like it. He didn't escape. Ah. Now, if I remember, actually, if I remember right, there's a projectile net you can shoot, but I don't remember how to do that. I'm trying to figure it out. Uh, I don't remember. 
Ah, well. Maybe that's a future upgrade. I don't remember it being that way. Yeah! Another monkey got. Grass is grass. This is pretty much the entire game. It's a very simple game. But, it's Ape Escape, which means it's friggin' awesome. And it's also kind of, it's crazy in the exact right way. It's like, it, Japanese games are crazy. This game is double crazy. Because Ape Escape is already kind of ridiculous. Oh, there's a monkey over here. Get out of there! Yeah! The, I, if I remember right, you can just combo a monkey indefinitely just by doing this over and over. But we won't worry about that. This game does get a little bit repetitive, I'm not gonna lie. And it does the Japanese thing that a lot of Japanese like crossover games do, which is where halfway through the game something changes and the game becomes not as much fun to play. We'll see what that is when we get to it. Yeah. But you know, it's a Japanese only game, no one's ever gonna play this game, and I think that's sad. And I was planning on playing all, all of the Ape Escape games on my channel eventually, so... Who cares, right? May as well start with this one, since the one I'm interested in playing. I haven't finished it yet. Lost my save before I could. Get over here! I forget how many stages are in this game. I'm pretty sure I got close to the end, though. So I know most of what's happening. There's one boss fight later on that's bullcrap. And if you want to get all the best gear, you need to farm it a little bit. I hate that one. Okay. Okay, yeah. So, this is what I'm thinking of. In this game, if you knock an enemy down, you can't strike them until they get back up. However, you can OTG an enemy. Oh, this is a fighting game terminology here. You can OTG an enemy with an aerial attack. And this is how you hit them when they're on the ground. So if you see me just doing this over and over, it's A, because it's cool, and B, because I want to hit the guy on the ground. This game is also somewhat hard. And I'm no pro, so expect death. Not too much death, but at least a little bit. Goodbye. And, uh... I, mentioned, I don't know if I mentioned this, I'm going to be treating this as a let's play, but I am streaming it. I'm planning on doing a new episode every Friday or Saturday evening, live stream. So if you ever have questions and that I don't answer in the YouTube comments when you ask them, uh, you can come to the chat in, on Twitch TV slash Recky Wills, or whatever the hell the URL is, and uh, ask them during the stream. You're up. Oh, right, you can get in the mechs, I forgot about that. But I want the monkey! Give me the monkey! That was close. Now let's get in the mech. These things drive like ass, and I also forget how to use them. Uh, circle does that. Oh, you can uh, select the gadget. Okay. Cool. Uh, camera. Let's go, son! Eat it! Oh, God. Oh god, please don't teleport away while this is happening. I don't know if that can happen, but please don't do that. Get- nope. 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 Thank you. I swear to god there's a projectile in that. I just don't remember how to use it. You know, it would really help if I could. I swear- oh, there it is. Yeah, you have to hold the button down, that's why I couldn't figure it out. <laughs> Okay, uh, switch to rockets. Die! This game makes no sense, and it doesn't try to make sense. Don't even pretend. Get over here. Uh, yeah, yeah. I love this game. This game's so dumb. It's so friggin' awesome, though. Yes! And there's seek optional monkeys. Like, if you go over here, there's... When you come back, there's monkeys that weren't there before. Or, there should have been. Maybe it's after I get this guy. Oh! Uh, oh! Uh, yeah! Super Mario Triple Jump right there. Let's see, if I go in here now... There they are! Yeah, yeah! Can I get two monkeys at once? 
Yes, I can, and you do get a combo for that. That is not a glitch. Or at least, it was a glitch that turned into a feature at the very least. Get down! Who said you can rule the sky? Ah, yes. Okay, uh, let's go to this mech, and I'll show you a secret skill. Yeah! Most of these skills are in... Most of these skills are in, uh... Ape Escape Pumped and Primed, so if you played that game or know the skills there, you'll know what to expect here. Get... There you go. Now where's that monkey? Projectile net, sucker! Oh, let's see how many times I can combo this guy. I mean, you can combo him, but definitely. There's no escape for this guy. I just looked at the chat. Brute said that UFO can pull this guy. Well, too bad. Okay, let's see. What other skills do we have? Poor little monkey. Oh, yeah! Actually, and with we have enough uh, juice, let's do one more. Ah, dimension break. My old standby in Pumpkin Prime does so much damage. These monkeys got guns, son. These guys, I think they're tough. My net is a gun. There's no escape. Oh, right. These guys will go after you. This game is not designed to be fair. They did not balance this game at all, so expect things to be bullcrap. A lot. And I will probably complain. Okay, just gotta make sure that I'm not missing anything. I mean, it doesn't matter. It's not like there's a reward for getting a certain amount of points. At least I don't think there is. And I can't go down there. Alright, looks like that's it. You, mo- no. You, monkey. Come here. If you're not locked on to stuff, it can be hard to target. But who cares? Okay. Let's go! I have a gun, too. And I have a better gun than you. Probably some better shot with it. hoo -ha! You don't even have to hit them with the actual strike of the club, you just have to have this club out when you're doing the thing. Oh, check this out. I'm gonna run into him. Run! Oh, sorry. And then you go, Wee! Come on. Like, this game is not a very good game. I'm not gonna lie. It's probably one of the weaker of the Ape Escape games. But this game is so cool. Yeah, yeah. I want to say there's a new Ape Escape coming out soon, like Ape Escape 4, and it uses like this art style, which it's a different art style than uh, the other Ape Escapes. Uh, Kadomi, Chipu, and Kobaru Ch Chipu. Yep, that looks like it. That looks like I read that kind of kind of right, right off the top of my head. I feel proud of myself. I haven't looked at a Hiragana or a Katakana chart in ages. Now, I don't know how long this episode's gonna be. I don't wanna make it too long. But it's Akihabara, so we'll do one more stage. And then, uh. Yo, Chris? Can you go to my room and on the book kit, on the bookshelf above the PS2 games is a case with the box art for this game? Can you grab that for me? It's on the second row of the bookshelf where the PS2 games are. It's like in the top right, top left corner. On top of the games. That's my list of uh, chip combinations. So we can do a little bit of chip putting together r right before the end of this episode. I guess we could just save that for the end of the episode every single time. But some of the stuff you get is just so useful, you want to make it right away. Okay. So, this game, or uh, this mission, I should say, reminds me a lot of Mega Man Legends, which is a Fantastic video game, which you can play on PC or N64 or PS1. And PSP if you want to play in Japanese. Come on! Break! 
Okay, uh, monkey, there's a monkey right here. There you are. Give me. Give me your face! Who's ah? Come on. Break! There you go. Good job. Good job, Spike. You can do a thing. Now, I don't think I'll ever show any other characters during the main game, but I think once I finish this game, I'll go show off all the characters in, uh, one go. Just like, let's mess around in Ape Escape, basically. But they all basically play the same. The gadgets are different, if I remember right. Like, they all form the same basic function, but they're different. So, figure that one out. You gotta get that monkey. Monkey! No escape! You don't have to get him. I didn't get him. The truck went to the next area. Where are the UFOs? Okay. Your ass is mine. Wait, I've already done this side. I gotta go to the other side. Hooah! Ow. Let's use the hurricane thing. Hooah! Ow. How dare you use your gun on me. Should I even bother getting the monkeys? It doesn't really matter. Huzzah! I'm not gonna bother, I'm just gonna kill the truck. Oh! How dare you! How dare you! I don't think I hit that guy. Just use the hurricane then. I'm sure that did something. Can't tell. Bad camera. It's bad. Oh yeah. Truck is dead. Guys, I killed the truck. I'm playing Sonic Adventure 2 Battle over here. Goodbye, truck. I also could not tell you uh, why we had to blow up that truck. I, I don't know. Okay. Let's see. Baru and Geruma. Oh, we might actually be able to make something of worth with our chips. We can definitely make something awesome. This this chart is weird. This is and it took me a long time to make. <laughs> I forgot the live action in this game. エノーマスエアバトル専門家たちはこれらの盗まれたバナナは最前線のサルたちに供給されているとそうて栄養価が高くサルたちの鉱物であるためです。これまで多くの事故が報告されています。戦艦から捨てられたバナナの皮によって地域住民たちが足を滑
しかし、いまだ対サル地球防衛戦線の攻撃によるのか、地域住民の努力による結果なのかは不明です。しかし、サルたちが運転していたトレーラーが大破して現場に残されており、レーザービーム砲も発見されたとのことです。専門家たちはこのレーザービーム砲のシステムは我々の現代の科学では解明できずまた相当な攻撃力を持った武器であろうと話していますサルたちは同じレーザービーム砲を配置した基地を海岸のコンビナートと近くに建設しているという報告も入っています軍事評論家によるとこの一帯をサルたちに制圧されることは防衛上大変な危機となるだろうと述べています単純なサル事例によるものではなく巧妙に配置された攻撃であるからですこのことは地域住民たちに深い懸念を呼び起こしています以上最新のニュースでした This game is the best game because Japan is the best game developer because no one goes no one is crazy like Japan when they have an idea they they go for it man it's fantastic oh my god it's fantastic anyways uh, gotcha mecha pole gotcha do to do let's see uh she 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 be Something, something. What's that? I don't remember what this does. What is this? Gotcha, Mecha. Something, something. Costume. Why are we making? Oh, that's okay. Recipe make. Okay. I have my list. Let me see. I want to make Kobari. Oh, damn it. We only have one of these. I wanted to make two of these. Okay. Uh, guys, Galif. Brute, you have a choice because you're the only ones watching this right now. Do you want me to make a machine gun? And by machine gun, I mean a pistol that shoots really fast. Or do you want me to make a bigger sword? And by bigger sword, I mean like big sword. Just have to wait for them to uh, actually hear this. This might take a little bit. Mr. Brute Hater says bigger in all capitals. So, and then Gal says big sword. Okay. So, Kobaru and. Oh, oh wait. Aw, oh, damn it, I don't have that chip. Never mind, we can't make the big sword. Crap. But, uh, we can make the machine gun. So, let's make the machine gun. Machine gun making! Shazam! Literally, it says, Ma Chi Gun. It's a machine gun. That's where I got the name from. You know, in the English version of this game, I don't think I could fit this in here. I'm gonna call it the Rapid Gun. Uh, in the English version of Ape Escape games, they always make it like a nice kid friendly name. And I don't know if that's how they did it in Japanese, but in this game, at the very least, they're just friggin' guns, man. There's no, like, no colloquialism. It's just a gun. Anyway, what other chips do I have? Do I have anything I can use? I have a Geruma chip, uh, which I don't know if I can use. Let me look at my list here. I don't have anything down for it. So either it doesn't make anything of worth, or I never tried. What else do I have? Cuddle me chips. I have something here. But cuddle me... I... only have Samui. Which is... he's a baseball monkey. Yeah, I don't see Geruma on here at all. Geruma, actually, no. Yeah, okay, so we... Don't have anything that we can use Garama with. So that was fun. So, uh, so be Henkel. Is that equipment change? I always forget. I believe it is. 
rapid gun. Uh, it's probably going brain dead on my menus. I forget how to. I forget how to do stuff. Oh right, this is the. Uh, you can get power up parts for your weapons and make them awesome. Like you can make it so it reflects stuff, or it shoots ice, or it's on fire. Which is, it is pretty great. Extra. Is there anything here worth looking at? I don't think there is. These are just movies, I think. Uh, Mechapone. Cheap menu. Well, I'll just save for now. And equip the gun on our next mission. But, I th that's about an hour of our time, I think. So I'm just gonna call it here. Next time on Let's Play. Sarugetsu, Million Monkeys, or Ape Escape Million Monkeys, as I'm going to call it from now on. We go to wherever the hell this next place is taking place in. There's uh, three kanji there, and I can't read those. That says, People Saru something something. Something something. Anyways, thank you for watching, everybody. I will see you all next time. Next week, same place, same time, probably, hopefully, at some point. Thank you for watching. I will see you all.